approaches. Lots of families out there are starting to plan for the vacation. So Becky Worley has three of the newest trends in summer travel that follow those double R's, rest and relaxation. And yes, it is possible even with the kids along. We're going to see how she does it with her twins. You plan, you pack, but what about the fun? According to our friends at Condé Nast Traveler, to get started, unplug. You'll see a family at the table and every member of the family has their nose you know, on the screen of their digital device. First tip, before you go, make a contract. We're not going to have iPods. We're not going to have movies. I'm not going to check my email all day. Let's do it. On the upside, it's kind of fun to go old school. Road trip, bingo. I'm hoping this keeps him busy for at least an hour. Ben circled things that he didn't see. Ben, did you circle things you didn't see? <laughs> You are a monkey. <laughs> Next, take everyone along for the ride. Multi-generational vacations are very 2013. Grandparents have a lot more patience generally with children than parents do. Also consider taking the four-legged members of your family. With more restaurants and hotels accepting canines, it can make your journey a lot of fun. Finally, take things slow. Can anyone say slowcation? Schedule less. Be spontaneous. When you see something cool, pull over. Today's highly scheduled Whoa. kids will really remember their parents just winging it. Yuck. So as you head out for your summer adventures, unplug, under schedule, and enjoy the whole family. Woo! We made it! I can't promise a trip free from missteps. <laughs> but these are steps in the right direction. Have a happy vacation. For Good Morning America, I'm Becky Worley, ABC News. Stinson Beach, California.